fitted. Oh, and she dropped the heel in the spin. Very dynamic leaps. Quite an amount of marks given for artistry now. So the gymnasts are working hard to inject character into their routines. in the title this year. Well, it's certainly a case of job done on floor. Lance's last bar performance gets a 13.725. And their minds focus on B. Ariella Kaislin. Gymnast. Can she stay on the beam? That's the question. Nice start, good solid. Round off layout, two feet on, which makes it a difficult opener. She did it well. Lovely again. Round off, straight summit. So, this is a great start. Maybe used to seeing Bolt with great confidence and here she is on the beam looking just as fluidly good strong solid side somersault circle around the beam nice and confident Leap. And here comes the all-important spin. Out of control. Very precise in her connections. Good, confident performance so far. Kaisling. Can she just maintain this? Double pike, and that was good work from her. Well done indeed for Switzerland. Kaislin then 14.05 for Switzerland in their first ever team final. waiting for the score the execution score is in that's how the gymnasts have been deducted but the difficulty scores not there the um, judges add all the difficult moves up and come to a score so there must be one or two moves they can't quite decide whether they're crediting or not it was that little step forward you were talking about yeah perhaps. yeah maybe and um, you know she did a couple of difficult spins where she just dropped the heel before the completion if they drop the heel they they don't give the triple spin they call it only a double you know that's only worth 0.2 whereas the triples worth 0.3 so those are the sorts of decisions we're waiting for This is Katarina Kovatova. And the round off. Double twisting. Straight. In the second flight. She whipped that last half twist in very late. And in fact, her feet weren't right round, I don't think. Mm -hmm. 
eagerly awaiting the score for Romania on floor. She cannot wait, and there it is. It's 14.2. Yes, that's good. Worth waiting for, I think, is the answer. So, Nicole Hibbert for Great Britain prepares for her bar routine. She'll be the first gymnast of the three for Great Britain to bounce from the springboard and up onto the bars. Not on her shoulders here. Hits a handstand. Torn and off. Into the Kachev. Has to be big so that it can go straight down to the Pax Alto smoothly. Now back up to the high bar. Has to swing down to the low. Lean at the moment. She's a powerful gymnast. Up to the handstand again. Full pirouette. Has to show a forward element. Here it comes. The forward giant now into the big display. Can she land? Absolutely great. Well, the crowd go wild here in the National Indoor Arena. Things going well for Great Britain so far. Marvellous to see that. What a way to start. Vince Ward are delighted with that, and so he should be. And uh, Nicole Hibbert, member of the famous Heathrow Gymnastic Club. <laughs> Lifts into this dismount, two front somersaults, times the exit exactly, meets the floor with a big, big smile. Brilliant. Full of energy, isn't she, Nicole? Wonderful to talk to her yesterday coming into this. Just absolute excitement, you know. Wonderful to be here. Here they are, making their mark on the senior stage. And we've talked about, you know, quality and depth within the squad, and um, she's a great example. She is not always the cleanest performance, you know, occasionally if you're close to a, a little bit bent leg. 14.0 for a confident start for Russia at their first vault. But whatever Nicole loses in execution, she makes up for in dynamics, fabulously dynamic. And yeah, Stefina. Little skip. She's away. Another double twist from them. Such a there's a contrast, isn't there, from the start? The way she just focused in on the vault there, and then that beautiful smile at the end. Incredible. And consistency is the name of the team game. Good vaulting. for Great Britain. Combat. Nicole Hibbert, 13.575. First of the beam route. First of the bar routines for Great Britain. This turf time, it's Becky Downey's turn. Such a key performance. Has big releases. The full pirouette into the toe on Kachev, massively high. She has very difficult combinations here. One and a half into the stall to Kachev, cleanly through both of them. It's a long routine. She has to keep going here, the forward element that she finds harder, but she's clean there. Up to the high bar again. Needs to keep some energy for a big dismount. Lifts up well, into the air, full twisting, double back, fantastic routine from Becky. Absolutely superb. Becky, she hit it when it mattered there. I mean, goodness me, had a shaky warm-up and my, nailed it. My hat is off to these. That's two super routines to start. And, of course, we've got the greatest bars worker in Europe to follow. Say nothing's the best. But uh, those are two super routines. Absolutely, here. Yeah. The half turn into the endo. The gymnasts have to swing in different grips, you see. She's in a forward grip there, and she's had to work very hard at that. It's not something she's found so easy, but it worked well today. Russia going very well indeed. A score of 14.7. That's going to keep them up there, no doubt about it. So the Russian gymnasts to vault. Yeva. Plenty of power and aggression on the approach. There you are. Another double twist. Three. That's top class vaulting from all three in this team. That's the way to go. 
what a team. I mean, you know, the, the grace and elegance of floor, and then you just pull out the dynamic and power for the vault. And power is the word here. Look at that approach. And the conversion is super. Good and high. Double twist all the way around. Caps a super team performance on vault. Lost her legs just a little bit. I was going to say that in, in normal speed, you can't see that so well, can you? And back to the smile. <laughs> Such an important routine now for not only Becky Downey, but of course for Great Britain, and everybody in the team knows it. 14.35. Brilliant score for Great Britain. That will certainly keep them in contention. So all eyes in this arena turn to Great Britain's Beth Tweddle. European champion on this piece of apparatus. Former world champion. It's all right to have a new team then, isn't it? It is. <laughs> it is. Come on, Beth. Top scorers on this piece of apparatus qualification. But such a hard routine, very little room for manoeuvre here. The big mark lock into the ginger, the trademark of two releases. Now these are the big releases. Turn off, pipe to catch her feet together. Now the original one, can she catch in the mixed grass? Back to the low bar, fantastic. Watch, hold your breath. Can she make this? It's the difficult half turn smoothly up. Now she has to hold strong. Go for the big dismount. We're there. Top on bars again, I'm sure. Wow, what a performance from the British girls. Beth Kim here. She did the job. <laughs> this is really, really something to witness. What a team performance. And that is just the icing on the cake. World, world, universal class. Fantastic work from her. Great stuff. Well, they were three marks ahead of any other team in qualification on asymmetric bars. And, uh, well, they've set a benchmark here. They're going to be tough act to catch, I think. Here, the ginger catching securely. Legs locked together. She's just got so much difficulty. That's the big thing about this beer bar routine. They've come up already with the difficulty mm. score of 6.8, which is massive. She did that over eight elements, of course. That's incredible, isn't it? That is. That's the gymnasts. They count. The judges count the highest eight elements. 14.575 for Russia on vault. Well... A different class. I mean, I know we've talked about it. Beth, it just seemed to just set this place on fire as soon as she jumped up onto those bars. And it's the connections, isn't it, Chris? It's wonderful stuff. 15.85, an enormous score for Great Britain. I tell you, that's certainly built the momentum that has. And halfway around as well. So, Ferrari. Revving up for floor. <laughs> You've been waiting to say that all day, Matt. Not that it's rehearsed, of course. Not at all. <laughs> <laughs> I remember you coming up with a Ferrari on pole position. <laughs> yeah, they're all there. I've got them written down, actually. <laughs> well, let's see what you can do here. Started well on beam. Bit of a shaky start. The wrong music. She first came to preeminence on floor and she was just electric with her work. She lifted the roof. The audience. Not today. What a day. 